Alrighty, so it's Australia Day here in Melbourne and uh, I've just arrived at Flinders Street Station and I wasn't actually going to start vlogging just yet but as soon as I've gotten here there's like these huge ass crowds behind me and everything and I'm wondering what the hell is going on it's obviously some sort of Australia Day event but uh, we'll check it out Look at all the police here <laughs> Got a whole barricade going off I'll walk down this way and I'll see what's going on Sorry mate So, I thought it was an Australia Day parade, but I think it's a abolish Australia Day parade. So, we'll figure out what it is exactly. I still don't really know what it's all about, to be quite honest. It's sort of a, sorry mate, sorry. just sort of mixed signals going on with all the signs happening. So, some are saying like destroy white supremacy and others are holding up Aboriginal flags. When I came into the city today, I was not expecting this. Here I was thinking that I was coming to meet a friend in the city to uh, do a just do a general vlog, but mostly on the reasoning of why I've started vlogging. And I've stumbled across this huge thing. And in a way, it kind of is the reason why I like vlogging because, and I want to start doing something like this because, you know, just putting yourself out there, you never know what you're going to get involved in. Alrighty guys, so... My phone just died before when I was filming because I didn't realise that there actually wasn't enough charge in the phone. And here we are, welcomed with Kyle, who we had to find each other because uh, my phone was dead. Alright, so we're going to give the, uh, the good old KFC trick a go. Oh shit, we're standing on some... Some, uh... That was cool. Yeah, we're trying to get a thing in box. Oh yeah, something like that. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're back near the front of... Uh, where Flinders Street Station is, well near this area on um, on Swanston Street and uh, the whole celebration sort of died down big time now that uh, my phone's charged again because good old Kyle's let me use his power pack, thank yeah, God. You're welcome. Uh, <laughs> um, so we are a little bit hungry at the moment. So for those of you that don't know, there is a trick called like, well it, it can work at pretty much any fast food place basically, you just call up and you just say, oh, I'm missing a meal. So we're going to see if that works with KFC. And um, what we're going to do is we're going to give some of the meal away to some homeless people. Hello, my name's Nathan. Um, I came in with my mates about 15 minutes ago, roughly, and we ordered like a bunch of food. And I'm actually missing a large Zinger Burger meal. Um, we've just sort of walked away and we've realized, should I just come back and pick it up? So who do I ask for when I get there? Okay, amazing. Thank you so much. Awesome. No worries. Bye-bye. Hey, sorry. I just called up about the, uh, the Zinger Burger meal over the phone. Uh, is the manager in at the moment? Yeah. Hey, I just called up over the phone about the Zinger Burger meal. Yeah? Yeah. Do you want a marshmallow? Yeah, that's right. That's right. Cool. Sorry, Thank you. It's okay. It's all good. Alrighty. So we got the KFC. 100% success rate so far, but what we're going to do is we're actually going to give this food to a homeless person. I don't know, you know, I can always come home and get food anytime I want, you know, and I've got money on me, so we're going to give this to uh, just someone. We're just going to go around and ask. It's a full-on Zinger meal. This is a large Zinger meal from KFC. Would you like to take that? It's just like a Zinger meal from KFC? No worries, mate. Have a good day. See you later. No worries. See you later, mate. Bye. Alrighty, so we're back at the Melbourne Exhibition Centre. We're going to go charge some of our packs. Do you know how much it is to actually charge it? It's f wait, it's free. What? You're joking. Free power? 
No. No way. So it's not free. Five dollars for one hour. So it's up to you, buddy. <laughs> Alrighty, so we're going into a big shopping centre called DFO and um, yeah, we're just going to look around and just sort of chill. I need some new shorts for the vlogs, so I think I'm going to do some shopping. I don't think I like any of the, uh, the shorts they have here. I'm sort of going for the all black sort of vibe and they don't really have any, so I might go somewhere else. Alrighty, so we've just been shopping for a bit. I got myself some nice shorts to wear, I'm wearing them now. Good old vlogging shorts. I'm going to use them in some of the, uh, the future vlogging videos. Alrighty, so quick update. We've just been chilling inside at the moment. Uh, just nice to sit down and chill, but uh, we're just out at the moment. And uh, we're going to be watching this show for a bit, so we'll see how we go. Alrighty, so while I'm here in the city, just chilling on the riverbank at the moment, I just kind of wanted to have a discussion with Carl, or well, kind of to you guys, just sort of discussing the reason why I've started vlogging, you know. And it's just, I don't know, I just see like in general life, in, in all forms, no matter what industry you're a part of, there's just so much negativity and uh, there's so many people out there who will like try to put you down and believe you can't achieve things and I don't know, with this sort of channel I just want to be able to like to prove to you guys that you know anything's achievable if you put your mind to it doesn't matter from what walk of life you are your past history anything like that you can do it and you can achieve it you know and um, we live in a huge world full of so many different people and to be able to go out there and try new things and and make a difference and just give things a go it, it helps you grow as a person and um, yeah. and it can help benefit people around you as well you know what I mean that's right or whatever <laughs> totally just ruined that <laughs> so sort of the the main idea of the channel is to to prove that anything is possible if you put your mind to it you can achieve anything and the main thing is just is just with anything that you do just put yourself out there you know if you want to start something or there's something that you've always wanted to do just start it just put yourself there it doesn't matter if you're going to embarrass yourself or you know you're scared of what people are thinking to think of you just go out there and give it a go regardless because at the end of the day I know it's really cliche to say this but you only get one chance at life you know and the world's so full of so many full of so many people that you know they're too scared to, to take that next step and one thing I believe in is just just give it a go and if you enjoy it keep sticking with it change how you do it try new things and eventually if you believe in it and you keep trying and trying and persisting you'll eventually get there and uh, I think that's what the idea of this channel is Alrighty, so we're at the uh, National Gallery of Victoria. We're gonna see if we can get in. We're pretty sure it's free. So uh, we'll see how we go, we'll test it out. God, I haven't been here in so long. Such a trendy place. Damn. Just really quickly while the security guard's gone. Look how sick it is in here. Look how cool it looks. Holy shit, that's so cool. Alrighty, so we're sort of outside now, we're sort of we're still in the exhibition area, but there's like like an outdoor coffee place, and there is no one like in this garden. Like there is no one here. Like there is literally no one here at all. Oh Shit, God, Carl! They're, they're guessing us. They they're trying to guess us. Please. They're trying to guess us. Fuck! I'm scared to walk in here. Oh shit! What is going on? I'm hearing water spraying. Oh my God! They're guessing us. Fuck! Ooh. We're gonna get out of here, Kyle. <laughs> <laughs> Alrighty, so I'm just sitting down with Kyle at the moment. He's meeting up with one of his mates. So um, afterwards, I'm going to head down to Docklands. So I'll meet up with my cousins in there. So I'm going to say goodbye, Kyle. In the meantime, I'm say goodbye. Bye. Add me on my Instagram. Alright. One, two, three, four, with five e. Alright, cool. Make sure you add him on Instagram. I'll make sure I link it in the description. Alrighty, so we're here in Docklands at the moment. And there are so many people here. This is the actual Australia Day celebration. So I think my cousins are at a restaurant just up there. Hopefully I can get in, but apparently there's a lot of people there, but we'll see how we go. Um, but it's really nice night tonight. Like I'm loving the weather. It's amazing.
So, I'm at Docklands. I finally met up with the cousins. On the left is Mitch. On the right is Ben. And uh, we're just going to chill and we're just going to go and see a movie. So, it's just been a pretty good day today. Alrighty guys, we've finished the film. I'm going to end the vlog there. We watched Glass and it was actually extremely good. So, I highly recommend it. But anyway, if you haven't liked the video, please do if you enjoyed it. And uh, subscribe for more content like this on my channel. See you later. Thank you.